Now, shape in Belgium. The Supreme Headquarters Allied Powers Europe is NATO's central command and controls the alliance's operations across the globe. The site near the town of Mons is also home to almost 400 British personnel, among them Sergeant John Brown, who works for Britain's joint European training team. He's been giving our reporter Rob Olver a snapshot of life for a British soldier in Belgium. As a member of the Royal Regiment of Fusiliers, Sergeant John Brown has been in the army for 28 years. But this is his first experience of shape. It seems quite daunting when you come to a place called the Supreme Headquarters. You know, you, you just don't know what to expect at first. John arrived in Belgium in April when the JET Joint European Training Team moved to shape from Rheindalen in Germany. It's a little bit more relaxed than I was expecting. But, it's, you know, there are some very important people here, obviously. Unless there's a reason to be uh, somewhere else, then, you know, during work, then you probably wouldn't uh, bump into them. So it doesn't really have a major effect on you, except the, uh, the helicopters that come in every ten minutes. <laughs> I can place my hand on his head, grab him by the shoulder and shake his shoulder. The team's job is to prepare personnel from British detachments at NATO bases across Europe for military operations in places like Afghanistan. There is going to be some form of nervous reflexes. That's not necessarily a sign of recovery. Today's students are fellow members of SHAPE's United Kingdom Joint Support Unit. We often conduct um, some form of ad hoc training um, when there's not actually a course on. So, for example, um, we may have to do some um, battlefield casualty drills or catch someone up on weapon handling. The GSR conversion's OK for the 23rd and the 24th. Because the JET team has only recently arrived, not all its training facilities are ready yet. The search continues for a suitable shooting range in Belgium. Cutbacks have also reduced Sergeant Brown's team from 11 to 4. We now need to do that little bit more and manage our time probably just a little bit better than we did before where we could afford that, um, the redundancy for um, people to get away on courses and stuff. We can't really afford to do that now. If we can get the flight from Brussels... One regular port of call is the travel cell. Busy staff in NATO outposts from Scandinavia to the Bosphorus can't always easily get to Belgium for mandatory training, so John will fly to them. But he says life in shape isn't all work. The best place I was posted was Cyprus, and I ran the water sports centre out there for four and a half years, so um, I don't think it gets much better than that. But it's probably the second best place I've been posted. Shape is much closer to home than his last posting in Germany. A drive to the Channel ports takes only 90 minutes, and there are other attractions. We've done um, trips um, from here up to Brussels. Um, Paris is only about 250 k's away, so maybe there's a Euro Disney on the cards. <laughs> Sergeant John Brown's workplace is also surrounded by history. Just outside Shape is the place where, in 1914, the first shot of the First World War was fired. And across the road is the spot where the fighting stopped more than four years later. Those that are interested in it, there's absolutely tons of historical events, you know, from here. And then most of them are signposted even. The nearby town of Mons also has its appeal. They've got a, a big town hall, a big square. Uh, most things lead off that. They've just recently had what, since what we've been here, is a massive festival, absolutely jam-packed. Um, and you could hardly move in the square. At times, John Brown admits there aren't enough hours in the day to do his job, but serving in Belgium, he says, most definitely has compensations. It is a cafe culture, Mons. It's not what we're used to, I would, I would say, but uh, well in Rome, do as the Romans do, they say. And wherever Sergeant John Brown goes next, he says, a posting to shape could be hard to beat.